and I am going to be doing a full face of how I used to do my makeup. No, I can't. I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't do that. I'm going out after this. What about a full face of me watching my own tutorial and insulting myself? That's a good one. Okay. Got the Mac. We are going to be putting her on the screen. When I'm referring to her, I'm referring to to like 2000 and whatever year it was me. That's my Barcelona vlog. If you guys wanna go and look at that. I've been having a look. There's one that I did two years ago, five minutes long. Okay, there wasn't an updated one, but there was one where I was bold. Which one should I do? Which one? I don't know. Change of scenery. I have got one eyelash on, I know, and it is. Why do you look annoyed? I'm just upset. At what? Because there's gonna be oil on my scalp in a minute. I noticed that his scalp was really fucking dry yesterday, so I'm gonna put some well oil reflections on it. Anyways, oh. because Larry's only got scalp, I'm gonna literally just do one pump. Look at how gorgeous that smells. Mm. And. Oh. How do I know you're not allergic to this? I have an SPD! Uh, what? <laughs> oh, I really don't like the feel of oil. Well, I don't know if you wanted shiny hair, but now you have shiny hair. I don't want shiny hair. You know, your sc I think we need another pump. Or maybe we do need the hair up. Maybe my skin's not... that dry, it's just soaked all yeah, in. I think your skin is very dry. Can you hold the bottle up here? Because I want to be quite close to your scalp if you look down a tiny bit. And I don't want to use that much. Yeah, that, yeah, that worked. Do you feel moisturised? I feel the same, to be honest. But that's it, I just wanted to do the back, I would do the top, but then it would I actually look greasy. Well, I need to actually style this. Now that that is done, we've moisturised his head, which I'm very happy about. I just feel like I really want to look out for his scalp, you know? Oh, it smells gorgeous. I'm just taking these off so that I have a fresh, nice eyelash base. I'm just going to clean my eyes and then reapply. So the options are this makeup routine, which is five minutes from two years ago. My proper, proper old one. Or this one, one year ago, and I was bold. So that one. one. The bold one? Yeah. Why? Because you were bold. Okay, fine. Natural spider. Oh my god, there was a spider on my hand and I started the video like that. No. Hey! I can't believe I did that. Should we just watch what she does whilst applying my lashes and then I'm gonna pause it and then insult her and do it at my own accord. Let's do that. She's bold, which is a complete statement. Absolutely love that. I wouldn't do it again because I've already been through it and I already grew my hair out and that was such a tedious process. I regret it in the sense that I do want long hair now, but I don't regret it because I would have never been where I am now without my bold head. I love it, it does wonders and it's not heavy. Oh, I went in with the moisturiser. Wow, I will say that was a good so moisturiser. Cool. It's the Clinique moisturiser, which I have right here. Moisture Surge Intense Clinique. I have nearly run out of this bitch. Just gonna pause that. I'm gonna do the rest of my eyes and then come back to you because I need to put them on to be able to continue with this video. So I'm gonna do that very, very quickly and then we can go from there. Back, and for some reason, my lashes just aren't, they're just not comprehending. I'm gonna redo them when I come back anyway. Onto the exciting part, let's do what she's doing. I would actually still use this if I had enough of it, but I'm gonna try and scrape it out so that I can have enough of it. I moisturize my skin beforehand anyways, so it's great that she is as well. Turns out I do have enough, but it's only in the corners. Yeah, she's going down the neck. I've started to go down the neck with my moisturizer because I like to keep my neck moisturized as well as my face. And if I look this way, that's because that's my mirror. And down here is my video of myself. What does she do next? I don't like how she sounds. Okay, so the next thing I do after moisturizing, I've got it all next to me. I should have really sewn together. Oh my goodness. I've got a YSL concealer. Okay, so she's using a YSL concealer, but I don't use YSL anymore. However, I will admit that concealer was quite good. I have now adopted my Fit Me concealer 
but there is something that I will do just before putting concealer on, which is my brows. And I think she does her brows at a different time, but I've started doing my brows straight away. I'm gonna get my got to be. I don't like what's in this bottle because for some reason it just doesn't work for me. It's too wet and it doesn't dry nicely. So I go in with this. I unzip this because it's the also real got to be. And then I do like a tiny, I know it's dirty, do like a tiny blob like that. Do you see how it's like that? And then I go in like this because that, that coats this. I did just put some moisturizer in, but I'm just gonna, they're absolutely fine. I'm gonna go in like that. So this will let my moisturizer settle and like just calm it down into my skin whilst my brows are cooking. I put in like gel, rub it through, just to make sure that it does go through the entirety of my brow. It needs to get tacky. Whilst I do that to my brows, that's when I go in with the concealer. I think I'm just gonna put my hair up a little bit because it's kind of annoying me. She's using concealer, which I'm going to do now as well. She's going in with YSL, I'm going in with, so there's two Fit Me concealers that I use. I use shade 20 and I use shade three. I use shade 20 nearly all over my face and I use shade three on my under eyes to brighten up. I don't really tend to put it in here because that is going, I'm gonna be using this for that, but going like that one two and then on my cheeks that's where i go in with the coverage so i'm gonna go in like that one more time is it okay so it's 2 30 i need to leave the house at like 10 2 so that we can get somewhere by three we're going larry's mum's and i am really behind so then i go in with number three do you see how that is so much brighter then i go in, in the middle i'm not going to do any makeup on my forehead just yet and um, i will be after i finish my brows let's see how they're doing actually Okay, they're at the perfect stage. Okay, whilst they're doing that, what I do is I'm gonna grab my mirror. Whilst they're like mid, they're like mid dry. Do you see what I mean? So they are still moldable, but they're not completely, they're not completely dry. They're moldable. So I'm gonna mold them. Okay, I don't think I've done that well because I think they need a bit more time. And maybe I left some moisturizer on there, which I know I shouldn't have sculpting them to how I want them and I don't think that they've done that well today but we're going in for the light makeup look today anyway so that's fine I'm gonna take like a cotton swab and I'm just gonna go around them to make sure that all the product that was there is off so then I literally blend in and I'm just gonna see what she does while I'm blending Oh, even ivory was too dark for me back then. Okay, this could work. This could work. <gasps> I've got a whole set. Oh, shit. I'm so jealous. She's got a whole set of brushes and beauty blender. While she's excited about that, I go in and I dab. Never sweat. Never sweat. And I dab the darker shade in first because that's like my skin colour. That's like the closest I've ever found in concealers. That's my skin shade. And I technically use it as a foundation. Like I don't, if I, again, if I'm wearing like heavier makeup, I will do the brow or wear Fenty foundation. That's what I have. But because this is just concealer, I'm just dabbing it in. Do you see that difference? Like my skin just looks, let me do it on this side because it's sunlight. My skin just looks so much more even. Blend that in, make sure to do it everywhere so that it's not like and i'm really going in with the blending perfect now i go in with the lighter shade and i think i will be going over it in that little darker concealer but i'm going like that i'm dabbing upwards and into my corner but i'm dabbing a lot here because it needs to blend okay now i'm not going to go in with the other shade and i'm going to just take the excess onto my nose i don't really like putting a lot of makeup on my nose because it comes off so i'm just gonna that's the one thing i rub that looks like it's basically blended nice natural cutesy so i wet my beauty sponge there but i'm just gonna let you guys know i don't wet my beauty blenders anymore i use it dry with my forehead i don't do a lot on my forehead so i go in in the middle like that because my my mirror knows that i'm rushing and then i do one dab Perfect. She's doing brows next, but I'm just gonna blend this top bit out. And this is what I do with my routine as well. I'm blending so that it matches with my cheeks, but then I blend it only here because I don't 
again if i'm doing a more heavier look i will put a lot of like base on but i'm just blending it out so that it just blends into my skin like i'm not using a lot of product she's going in with contour i don't do that yet i need to finish my brows off before i go in with anything there's something poking my fucking eye it's this anyways we're moving on she's doing contour i'm not doing contour i'm using the tattoo brow by maybelline new york up to 36 7 36 hours i'm not too sure of the shade that this is but that's the lid i don't do the fronts of my brows i'm doing the ends of the brow i'm not going to be doing a lot i'm just going to be extending the tips the slightest bit okay so i know that that's extended really really badly but again i'm going to conceal around it and i'm just going to do this exact same thing to the other eye that's how it was meant to look oh maybe not i'm going to go in with the fit me again i'm only going to do like a dip dab yeah, two dabs of the darker one let's see the time 37 okay right i need to be ready really quickly and then I'm going to go in with the lighter one. I need to be rushing. I don't know why I'm going so slow. Blend it out here on the temple. With the excess on my brush, I'm going in and concealing. See, guys? Now that it's sharp. And then I'm taking the other side, getting a tiny bit of product, and I'm concealing. I'm not done too much to it, and it's very, very quick. Now I'll do exactly the same thing to the other side. And then I take this cute little sponge and I blend it out here. So let's see what she does. Shade. Cool. And contouring. I am actually onto contour next. Okay. Hair contouring is absolutely awful. I use these three brushes. So I do go in with my Laura Mercier setting powder first. Then I take this brush, the 402 setting brush, tap it on here. So I've got a bit and tap it off, tap it on, tap it off. And then I just put it under my eyes here because I like to make sure that my eyes are set for the day. And I tap it on. I do not, I do not smear it on. I tap it on because apparently that's the best. And then I take a tiniest bit and then I blend this in. I'm just doing that so the concealer doesn't move that much. I'm going to go in not with blush i'm gonna go in with my revolution mega bronzer in zero one cool and my rt 200 expert face brush with this i go in do you see there's a hollow bit there i go in there and i tap like that same on the other side hollow bit tap like that and then i do upward strokes and down to make sure everything's blended and i do blend in here up as well a tiny bit do you see that is perfect? So up here, so it's blended, blend upwards. And then the excess, and I take a tiny bit more. I go on my forehead, quite different to what she's doing in there actually. And I take the excess off it, on my nose. On my nose, just like that. I go in with my Fenty Beauty Blush. These two shades, Ginger Binge and Moscow Mule. And I go in with Ginger Binge with my Real Techniques 400 blush brush. I tap it, tap it. I used to hate doing blush, absolutely hated doing blush. And now I absolutely adore blush. It's like, it adds a little bit of, I don't know, like I can't describe it. A little bit of color and fluff. I don't like having too much of that on. So I go back in with the setting powder that I had left. I tap it on the brush, make sure it's in the brush, tap any excess off and I go over. So that one, it blends in with the rest of my skin. And two, it's not as harsh. She goes in with lashes. I've already got lashes on. Oh, I literally just put some plumping lip gloss on there. Well, I'm changing it up a bit more. I'm going in with my Revolution like that. I have a lip above my lip. Do you see? I go in on that because if I actually had that pigment in that part of my lip, I would have bigger lips. Then the tiny, tiny bit. So this is the L'Oreal shade 600. I know off by heart. No tough. This is the Revolution Brunch. I think it's a matte liquid lip, but I'm going in just like that. 
and that is the makeup look guys i think i'm just gonna have my hair up today or maybe not thank you guys so so much for watching this video today i know it was a little bit on the more rushed side my makeup looks better when i rush it anyways i'm gonna get dressed and we're gonna go and um, i think i'm gonna show you the final fit so let me just do the outro and the final fit actually this is the look oh you can hear our washing machine this is the look <laughs> We're gonna go in with the Lewis today. My makeup, it's like, it's so, it's there. And I, we do need to go. It's 51. Right, right back up.